than a kid no warrior. Prepare yourselves for a journey into the heart of mystery and intrigue as we unravel the secrets hidden within the Knuckles trailer. Did you notice the new characters? What about Knuckles having fire powers? You think you can take my power? A spin-off project led by Knuckles is on the way, and a new teaser trailer for the series is here, introducing us to a bunch of new characters and giving the beloved protagonist some new powers, fire powers. Fans were surprised to see the new powers since the character didn't have them in Sonic 2. The Paramount Plus series serves as a spin-off from the Sonic the Hedgehog sequel. The Sonic Cinematic Universe first introduced the character in the Sonic sequel, voiced by the amazingly talented and handsome Idris Elba. He played one of the key roles in the follow-up as he helped Sonic and Tails stop Dr. Robotnik from his evil plan of taking over the world. Do I look like I need your power? However, the new teaser for the series hints at the new challenges that the titular character is going to face and, of course, at the new characters he's going to meet after he embarks on a wild adventure. The official trailer was released on Paramount Plus's YouTube channel on January 8, 2024. Not surprisingly, the trailer looks really great, giving Knuckles some new abilities that are going to make him much stronger. Knuckles was already a very powerful character, but the fire powers he has in the trailer are going to take him to a whole new level. The trailer also reveals that the creators were inspired by the games that Sonic is based on. In fact, they took inspiration from various Sonic games when working on the spin-off. A lot of fans who have played the games know that the character had fire powers in the source material. Someone's about to get slapped. At the end of the trailer, viewers can hear the titular character saying that he is ready to fight, and then bursts of flames surrounded his fist. Given Knuckles' fire powers in the series raises several questions to say the least. I already mentioned this, but I feel the need to mention it again. The character had no fire powers in the sequel, so yeah, this whole thing is a bit confusing. Apparently, the creators were inspired by the 2001 game Sonic Adventure 2. If you Google this game, you'll see that in it, flames would surround Knuckles' fist every time he performed an uppercut punch. The flames' purpose was to lift the character higher when jumping. Knuckles also shows off his fire powers in Sonic Frontiers 2022. <laughs> But the fire powers in the series are not exactly the same as in the video games. In the trailer, the fire around Knuckles' fists appear before he starts fighting. The fire also appears after he starts fighting. In the trailer, he's just standing, preparing to fight as fire surrounds his fists. In Sonic Adventure 2, the flames appear thanks to the speed and power of Knuckles' punches. In other words, the flames only appear when he is in motion, unlike the case in the trailer where he's standing still, showing off his new abilities. In the games, it is explained that Knuckles gets these fire powers thanks to his fist-spilling molecules as he flies through the air. However, the creators of the series have changed this and given the title of character full control of his new abilities, meaning that Knuckles can use these powers whenever he wants. Nonetheless, it will be awesome to see the character showing off his new abilities in the series. What do you guys think about this? Share your thoughts in the comments before you officially meet Knuckles Pakekama. Super powerful. Recently saved the world with your friends. Blink and you'll miss it. The new character in the Sonic Cinematic Universe appears at 1.53 in the trailer. Thanks to some eagle-eyed fans, we now have plenty of theories regarding the future of Knuckles, Sonic, Tails, and the rest of the characters that appear in the trailer. Some fans couldn't believe that this was, in fact, Pekamak. Others were quick to identify the character thanks to the name badge on his shirt. The character had his debut appearance in the 1998 Sonic Adventure serving as the chief of the Echidna Warrior clan to which Knuckles belongs. We should note that the character only appears through flashbacks in Sonic Adventure. I'll be honest with you, I was shocked to see the character in the Paramount Plus series. Please, give a raise to whoever decided that he needed to be in the spinoff. But you're not giving me much choice! <laughs> <laughs>
but they also appear in other Sonic games. His last appearance was in Sonic Unleashed. By the way, Sonic Unleashed was released 16 years ago. He had some appearances in Sonic Archie Comics and Sonic X anime. So, what do you guys think about the new addition to the Sonic Cinematic Universe? Let us know. But wait, before you go, there is one more secret you won't want to miss. Keep watching to uncover the truth that could change everything you thought you knew about Knuckles. You need to know that Knuckles serves as a bridge between Sonic 2 and 3. Oh, and in case you didn't know, Knuckles will be a miniseries project and will serve as that bridge between Sonic 2 and the upcoming Sonic 3. In other words, Knuckles takes place after the events of Sonic the Hedgehog 2, which was released back in 2022. In the second installment, Sonic, Knuckles, and Tails joins forces in order to defeat Dr. Robotnik and they are successful in their mission. This means the three of them are embarking on a new adventure together in Sonic 3. In the upcoming series, we will see the three of them also acting together, and the events that happen in the series will lead to the events of the third installment. Now, let's meet the new cast members, shall we? Your mind. <laughs> After giving us no updates whatsoever, Paramount announced the exciting news with some big stars joining the Sonic Cinematic Universe. As mentioned before, we have Idris Elba reprising the role of Knuckles. Per a report by Deadline, the new cast members include Carrie Alwes, Stalker Channing, Christopher Lloyd, Paul Shearer, and Rob Hubel. The casting news also came with a short synopsis that confirms Adam Pelly's Wade is going to have a huge influence on the plot of the series. The the official logline says that Knuckles agrees to train Wade as his protege and teach him the ways of the Enkidna warrior. But what else did the trailer reveal? The fire powers and the unexpected Pekakamak cameo are two of the most exciting things we noticed in the trailer, but we're also happy to hear the voices of Ben Schwartz and Colleen Oshaganassi, who will reprise their roles as Sonic and Tails respectively. Bad time to say this, but I don't actually have a plan. However, we still don't know whether they'll appear in all of the six episodes of the series. Yeah, I know, six episodes are not enough, but hey, Sonic 3 is also coming out in 2024, so we have plenty of new Sonic content to look forward to. Luckily, Knuckles will be released much sooner than expected. The series will premiere on April 26. Fans in the US and Canada will be able to stream the series on Paramount Plus that day. However, people from other parts of the world will have to wait until April 27th to stream the series. As for Japan, Paramount claims the series will be released later in the year. That's gotta be embarrassing. In conclusion, Knuckles seems like one of the best Sonic projects in the entire franchise. It expands the Sonic universe by introducing as many new characters as possible. You need to remember that Sonic and Tails won't be the lead characters in this project. The trailer's main focus is on Knuckles, who takes on Wade as his protege and teaches him everything there is about being an echidna warrior. The two will face the evil Robotnik employee played by Roy McCann. You'll be happy to know that the Sonic video game universe is also expanding. PlayStation revealed Sonic X Shadow Generations at the latest state of play. It will release in fall 2024 for PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5. And there you have it, fellow adventurers. We've delved deep into the Knuckles trailer and unveiled some incredible secrets. But remember, this is just the beginning of our adventure. Stay tuned for more thrilling discoveries and don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates on all things Knuckles. See ya.